to the channel. Sorry, it's a little windy. I'm here at Horsetooth Reservoir with the 2020 Kia Optima S. So let's hop inside and get away from this wind so you guys can hear me a little bit better. But look at this ride. It's pretty, you got the dual exhaust on the back. Oh. That's right, the new 2020 Kia Optimas have arrived at I-25 Kia. The model we're in right now is the S trim level. So we're gonna drive around Horsetooth Reservoir and see how it handles, and I'm gonna tell you what I like about it. But first things first, we gotta get you buckled in. You gotta be safe in the Kia, even though you're already safe, pretty much. It's packaged secure. So the first thing I noticed when I hopped into the 2020 Kia Optima is how comfortable it is. These seats are very, very nice. It's a combination of leatherette and fabric. I really like the headrests. They're really comfortable. Kind of like a memory foam. It's not, but it's similar. The steering wheel is very nice. You've got your cruise control on the right, and you can adjust your speed. On the left side, you control your phone calls, and you can shuffle through your music. Pretty intuitive, very user-friendly, good feel. With this nice eight inch touchscreen display, you can access your Apple CarPlay, your Android Auto, or you can utilize phone calls, you can go through your music, or you can access your maps and easily navigate from place to place. This nice center console is very clean. I really like how simple this is. The only button you really have over here is for your drive modes, where you can shuffle between comfort, eco, and sport. Very spacious back seat with that nice leatherette that I was talking about the nice fabric. I love these these headrests. They're just super squishy, very comfortable. If I wanted to, with this 10-way motor-driven seat, I could just take a nap. But I can't because I'm working. I know my job's weird. All right, so you have a push button start. So let's go. Right out the gate, I'm gonna say I really like the get up and go of the Optima. This 2.4 liter gasoline direct injection engine comes with 185 horsepower and 174 pounds of torque. Its handling is superb. Because this is the S trim level, it's a little bit more of a sporty feel on the inside, the exterior, but the handling's a little bit more sporty than I expected. I have always been a fan of Kia's Optima, and I always say if I were to purchase a Kia right now, I think the best bang for your buck in terms of value is the Optima. This S level trim starts around 25, so pretty, pretty affordable, good value. This vehicle has most of the Kia DriveWise suite. Blind spot detection, lane keep assist, lane departure warnings, rear collision warnings, forward collision avoidance with pedestrian detection. So Kia is just further enforcing uh, the safety within these. I mean, this is one of the top rated safety vehicles on the market. Now I'm six foot tall, I have a lot of headroom. With this 10-way motor-driven seat, I can get to the exact height that I want. And your passengers in the back are gonna be very comfortable too. So overall, you have a very sporty look, especially with this front element in the grill. The nice tiger nose grill really complements the front. And you also have these very nice LED daytime running lights. And because this is the S, you have the 18 inch alloy wheels. And these are really sharp looking. And the back is also very clean. And you've got the very nice dual exhausts which I don't know if that's dual exhaust or just one exhaust that's been split. Like I told you guys before, I am no car expert. If you wanna know if those are dual exhausts, go talk to the car experts at I-25 Kia. They're the real pros. I covered a lot, but I certainly did not cover it all. If you have any questions about the 2020 Kia Optima, go talk to the car experts at I-25 Kia. Make sure to tune in next week because I'm hoping to get my hands on an SX version, which the SX packages are always amazing, so stay tuned. And if you could do me a favor, please like and subscribe, and have a great day. Bye!